What's going on guys, Adi here and today in this video I'll be showing you the CR Engine Mode 12.1 for Google Nexus 7. So without any further wasting time, let's straight into the video. The original Google Nexus 7 was released on back 2012 and that was the flagship lineup from Google and that time it was running on Jellybean but now we are running on the latest Android 5.1. As you can see friends, this is my Google Nexus 7 and I just recently installed the CR Engine Mod 12.1 on my tablet. So it is running on the latest Android 5.1. For the confirmation, let's go to the setting. Then scroll down to the about tablet section and from here you can see my Android version is 5.1 which is the latest Android lollipop and you can see my cyanogen mod version is also 12.1 which is the latest from cyanogen mod all the lollipop animations are available in this rom which feels nice and as you can see all the settings are similar like the previous build of cyanogen mod only some extra tweaks are available and as you can see these are some of the applications the rom comes with you will you can find the gfs package and everything in the description box if you want to check them out now on Cyan Mode 12.1, which is based on Android 5.1, you can directly access the Bluetooth and Wi-Fi settings from the status bar itself. There are some extra features and tweaks now are introduced with the Cyan Mode 12.1. Like when you go to the display setting, here you can find the live display mode. It will basically reduce your eye strain. So it is a good introduction with the Cyan Mode 12.1. And now the silent mode is also introduced with Cyanogen Mode 12.1 which is not available in the previous build. So it's a welcome change. And as you can see all the other settings are pretty much same as before so there is no change in the setting menu. One of the biggest feature of Cyanogen Mode ROM is the theme engine. And yes the theme engine is also available in this build of the Cyanogen Mode ROM. I have been using this ROM for quite some time now and I haven't noticed any lags or drop frames while I am testing this ROM. Everything feels snappy and everything works perfectly fine. No Bluetooth issue, no Wi-Fi issue, there is no issue or bug present in this ROM. Now let's talk about the battery backup. And yes guys, the battery backup has been improved and you can easily get 3 to 4 hours of on-screen time which is not bad for this old tablet. And I am easily getting around 6 to 7 hours of moderate using time, which is again pretty good. All the Android Lollipop and Cyanogen Mod wallpapers are also provided with this ROM. Let me show you guys. And as you can see, these are the wallpapers. And friends, I can easily recommend this ROM to use as a daily driver. There is no problem using this ROM in your daily to daily life. And as you can see, opening and closing apps are pretty snappy. The Google Nexus 7 has a front facing camera and the Cyanogen Mod 12.1 came with the Google camera application. And how the camera is? Let's see. And the front facing camera, as you can accept from a mid-range tablet, the camera performs good. So that's it guys for today's video and if you think this video is helpful then let me know by hitting the like button and subscribe to my channel to watch the similar content and friends i will be doing the installation guide video so stay tuned and if you want to follow me on my social networks the link will be in the description box and i always upload pictures to my instagram so follow me on that and your yeah, friends thanks for watching i will see you in my next one have a good day